Good morning, parents and students. This is Ms. Nardone, your technology teacher. Listen, I know there's a lot of issues going on with Brain Pop and clicking on links and the links aren't taking you where they're supposed to be and then the kids can't log in. And I, I get your frustration, I really do. And I feel, I feel terrible, but you know what? We're gonna get through this, just be calm. It will all work. So I'm gonna show you a couple things that you might encounter that might make you crazy. So let's go and I'm gonna use my daughter's account. Let's go look at a couple things, okay? So your teacher posts in your classroom um, an assignment to do in Brain Pop Junior, okay? They post a link for you. You're like, all right, I'm gonna click on the link and we're gonna go, all right? So here's my assignment and my, this is my daughter's and my daughter's. If I click on the link, Look what happens. It's not taking me anywhere. Now, mind you, my link is correct. <laughs> but also notice up here, it's taking you to brainpop.com. I don't know why. We can't explain it. So I'm going to show you. Instead of getting upset or, you know, saying we can't find it, we can't do it. Here's going to be the trick, okay? You're just going to simply, when you have a Brain Pop assignment, go to Brain Pop Junior, okay? You're going to go to login. Okay, you're going to put in your username and your password. Now, also remember, again, technology, we love it, but it's not perfect. So this happens to be our lunch number, but some people have to do their last name and then their lunch number. Okay, that's very few, very few people, and the kids should know who does and doesn't. You can always email me at nardonea at eht.k12.nj.us if you're having problems logging in because I'm the one that's been solving all those problems. All right, so once you log in, you're going to see up here, now you have your lunch number, you have your dashboard, you have notifications. If I click on my dashboard, It's going to show you the assignments that I have due, okay? Current assignments, overdue assignments, okay? Everything else in here, all right? Now, let's say those assignments aren't showing up there, and believe me, that happens too, all right? Then if you go to notifications, you're going to be able to see all the assignments that were assigned for your student. Now, let me get into other logistics. I am on Google Chrome right now. I'm using Google Chrome browser. That works the best, okay? If you can't get to things, it might be because of the browser. And I will also tell you that if you're using an iPad, there are certain things that can't be done on an iPad that need to be done on a desktop or on a laptop. Um, my daughter has not been able to do her writing on Brain Pop Jr. Um, she hasn't, it, a lot of people are saying they can't do the draw about, not everything is available on the iPad. Also, if you go on the iPad, I can't find the assignments on the iPad either. Okay. There's no dashboard. There's no notifications. So please bear with us. Please stay calm. <laughs> It'll be okay. This is all new to us. Brain Pop is actually a wonderful tool. Um, if you have any questions or you need any help, you can reach out to me, like I said, nardonea at eht.k12.nj.us. I'll be more than happy to help. And every Friday, I will be doing my lessons and posting them on my Google Classroom for you. And um, I'll be available for help during the help hours. Talk to you soon. Be well.